welcome to another video so today we will be discussing about the various chromosomal abnormalities guys i know many of you requested me for this video and here i am with this video thank you so much for subscribing to my channel and always leaving such beautiful comments for me so without much further ado let's get right into the video So firstly we will be talking about the down syndrome the format is i will tell you about the syndrome the associated chromosomal abrasion and the characteristics so the first one is down syndrome it is the most common chromosomal abrasion observed now there are three reasons as to how the down syndrome can be formed the most common reason is the trisomy 21 that is each and every cell of the body has an extra copy of the 21st chromosome the second reason is the mosaicism that is only a few of the cells they have an extra copy of the 21st chromosome and lastly it is called as a robertsonian translocation wherein basically there is a fusion of the long arm of the chromosome 14 and the 21 so q is basically the long arm of the chromosome okay now how are the characteristic features what are the characteristic features of babies or humans affected with down syndrome basically the most characteristic is having a flattened face and slanting eyes okay so other things that are associated is a decreased muscle tone asymmetric skull a protruding tongue and mental retardation so that's about down syndrome next you have the edwards syndrome again this is a trisomy but of the 18th chromosome it is the second most common after down syndrome and the characteristics are mental retardation many of the uh, infants basically they die due to major congenital abnormalities during the infant stage only but if a few of them survive then they do not have much problems however they still are not normal they have a characteristic hand appearance that is clenched hands and overlapping fingers so that's about the trisomy 18 edward syndrome next is the patau syndrome it is a trisomy of the 13th chromosome okay so three copies of the 13th chromosome it is very similar to the edwards only that you will not observe the uh, different abnormalities in hands that we used to see in the edwards syndrome then you have turner syndrome turner syndrome is the monosomy of the x so basically they have 44 plus x and nothing here okay these females the characteristic is that they have webbing of the skin in the neck basically they are sterile have a short stature hearing impairments and cardiovascular impairments next you have the klein filter syndrome so most common manifestation is the xxy other possible combinations are triple xy or double x double y so these are the other manifestations possible what are the characteristic small testes developed breast feminine voice knock knees however there is not much effect in terms of their mental status they are quite normal in terms of mental status next we have predu cut that is deletion of the short arm of the chromosome 5 okay now basically the characteristic which is asked in many of the exam is the high pitched cat cry like sound the infant makes so when the infant cries it sounds like a cat okay so that is because a short arm that is the chromosome 5 short arm which is given by p is deleted the consequences are mental retardation microencephaly that is a small head size hypertelorism that is eyes are widely spaced between the two eyes a lot of space they have a very low birth weight and muscle tone 
is also very less that is they are very weak and finally the last one is the de george syndrome de george syndrome is caused due to deletion in the long arm of the chromosome 22 okay characteristic symbol they have a cleft palate so basically above the lip you will see this cut like structure okay like this that's a cleft palate then you have cyanosis abnormal facial features and mental retardation okay so this is the de george syndrome they also have a weak immunity it has something to do with the development of the thymus so you can read more about that as well and it is basically due to the deletion in the long arm of the 22nd chromosome okay so that's it from me for this particular video if you want any more videos do leave it in the comments down below and that's it from me i'll see you in my next video bye